one step towards forever. Oh God. As read by Sir Zachary Sang. Uh, oh, thank you. Get, get to Today it. we will cover the topics from One Step to Forever. We'll talk about Justin Bieber being a celebrity. He yeah. says, until three years ago, Check that was my de that was my definition of a celebrity. Someone who gets to ride around in a Zamboni. A Zamboni? <laughs> he totally did not snap, write that. Snap. A Zamboni? Shelly, Shelly. Oh please, please. God. The master's trying to perform. <laughs> Thank you. This is what Justin says on dating. I hate being on a date where both people are working too hard to come up with stuff to say. You know, it's working when you can just chill. Listen to music. <laughs> watch, watch a movie or whatever without feeling like you have to force a conversation. It should just be natural. Yeah. This is what Justin has to You're say. You're not doing his words any justice. Yeah. This is what Justin has to say in his, in his book about being in a relationship with Twitter. He says, I got on there and started tweeting my brains out. I followed all my followers and friends, their friends. I replied and retweeted and commented and tweeted back and forth as the conversation got bigger and bigger. Want, want another one? Want another one? I feel like the uh, one about him not being able to pass his driving test is the best one. Because uh, he bellowed? I feel like it's the best one. I feel like I want to read it just to bring up my stamina. Craig, what do you think? Um, why, don't you, why don't you save it for the end? <laughs> oh, I see it. Oh, well, I did with that? Okay. Okay. This is what Justin has to say on, meet, on meeting uh, Usher and Justin Timberlake. He says, oh. it was like, Usher and Timberlake want to meet me? Are you kidding? There was, no, <laughs> there was no point in trying to tell anyone at school about this. It would be like telling them I was going to meet Chuck Norris. And we all know that guy is untouchable. I mean, come on. It's Chuck Norris. He doesn't need Twitter. He's already following you. Yeah. This is what Justin had to say on his first date in his book, First Steps to Forever. He says, My first date has been sort of like a mythologized as oh, Bieber's dating Next. disaster. Next. <laughs> I Wait, this is good. I took her to King's Buffet restaurant. Yes, I wore a white shirt. Yes, I got spaghetti. No, this was not the brightest idea. But it wasn't a big trauma, though. <laughs> what does that mean? Does what does that mean? How, how, what does that mean? How? I took her to King's Buffet. Yes, I wore a white shirt. Yes, I got spaghetti from King's Buffet. Doesn't King's Buffet sound like they're going to be serving, like, egg rolls and white rice and dumplings? There's a King's Buffet near me, and it's a Chinese restaurant. Thank you, okay? I think Justin needs to learn how to eat. But no, this was not a br not the brightest idea. <laughs> but it wasn't a big trauma, though. <laughs> Right. So, how did that? How did that date go? What was like? I, is there another chapter? Like, is there another paragraph after that explaining what what the trauma was? I don't know, but did it, they have it, a second date? I'm compelled. 